for sports fans. That's better. Gamble responsibly. It's pick a pair challenge time as we welcome back our two-time all-star, Carlos Buza. Welcome to the show, Carlos. Guys, thanks for having me. Uh, it's great to have you here. There's some awesome combinations in the league, such as LeBron and Davis, Zion and Ingram, Tatum and Brown, and Jokic and Murray. Carlos, I'm coming to you first. If you were playing one of my favourite games, NBA Jam, who's hitting up? Two versus two. Who would be your first pair picked? Uh, it's hard to pick go against LeBron, but right now I feel like Tatum and Brown are just on fire. They've been playing terrific basketball all season, leading that undermanned Boston Celtics team to a great record. And I, I obviously Middleton hasn't played this year to partner him with Giannis, so I'm going with Tatum and Brown. Well, this is where James, he's just he was scratching to get in. You, your pair, what are you looking at? I absolutely love this, Carlos, because I think at the moment we are in a golden era <laughs> of duos in the NBA. And I feel like you and Darren Williams might have started this. Can I actually pick oh. you and Darren? <laughs> just put you guys in the pick and roll. <laughs> NBA jam, off we go. Uh, I do love the idea of Tatum and Brown. There's there's like a combo there in New Orleans I actually really like as well. CJ McCollum and Zion, that's a, that's a tasty one. But for me... I think if I'm going NBA Jam, Dicko, yes. give me Giroud Holiday and Giannis Antetokounmpo because oh. for me that just screams out my all-time favourite duo of the NBA. Gary Payton and Sean Kemp of my beloved Seattle Supersonics. <laughs> this is like the, they've taken that and just run with it. You've got the uh, defence first point guard who can actually shoot better than the glove ever could. You've got an absolute dominating forward in Giannis just like Sean Kemp. And that's the combo I want for my NBA Jam team right there. I mean, there's some great ones out there, though. Harden and Bede, if Harden could stay healthy. We've got Booker and Aiton. We've got Trey and Dejunte. Dejunte, as we like to call them. You've got KD and Kyrie. <laughs> that's a good one, too. Uh, obviously, Giannis and Drew. How about Ja Morant and Triple J? Jaron Jackson Jr. I reckon if Triple J could stay healthy, by the end of this season, Dicko, we might be looking at this question a little bit differently. Well, I'll tell you what, you're throwing some beauties out there. All right, Carlos, is it too early to be putting Gilgis Alexander and our man Giddy in the same company? No, I think definitely. They're, they're having a good young season. Those guys are stars. I, I think they made a huge jump from last season to this season. Um, the guys that we've mentioned have just done it a little bit longer, been more consistent, and they've been at that high level for a couple of years now. So. Um, I, I think Shay and, and Gideon are right there, are the next up to be in that in that category. Yeah, I think I think I agree with that. But like the the vibe for Giddy is just not quite there at that superstar okay. level just yet. But defensively and scoring wise, like Shay is unstoppable. Like he is a top ten player easily this year. He's absolutely unbelievable. But I don't think they're quite in that tier just yet. Like you play them on NBA Jam, you're like, this is going to be fun. Let's go. You'd see <laughs> Giddy slinging down some passes. <laughs> Shay be dropping in bombs. It'd be great. But I don't know if they'd beat, uh, you know, the top-level teams. All right, let's turn fantasy into reality. Carlos, which of these double acts would you be building your team around right now? I'd build around Giannis. I mean, I, I would go uh, I would go with Giannis and Drew Holiday, Giannis and, and Chris Middleton, Giannis and anybody. I think Giannis is amazing. I think he does it every single night. He's so dominant in the paint. Uh, he would be like one of those on-fire type of NBA Jam players. He does it in real life every single night. I would build around Giannis. What about you, James? I actually, I love this. So I've gone with Giannis and Drew for my NBA Jam. Ooh. But for reality, I think it's probably Tatum and Brown who Carlos actually went for with his NBA Jam because I think when you've got the two dominant wings in today's NBA, it just makes everything easier. And you can sort of mix and match uh, essentially around them and away you go. And I think night in, night out, that's going to give you just probably the best opportunity to win. And because they're that little bit younger than Giannis and Giroud, I'd probably land with them in like real life. But I mean, it's hard to go past what Carlos is selling out there with Giannis. That dude is like, he's absolutely unstoppable. So you can't go wrong, I think, with either of those pairs. Well, you two are certainly heating up. Don't move an inch, Carlos, because it's time to go head to head with our man James in the big call. The betting brand for sports fans. That's better. Gamble responsibly. 